So my shop <coughs> is a mess. Um, it gets this way constantly. I clean it up, and then I just completely, you know, this happens. Okay. So, start by throwing out the old shot back. As you can see, very little free space in my shop. Mainly because of the giant ping pong table. Also because of this giant decrepit workbench that takes up the entire back wall. So I'm putting them out of their misery and I'm using their parts to make a new Frankenstein workbench ping pong table. Okay, now that we got our parts and we're all cleaned up, we can actually get started. I don't have a track saw, so I'm just using the factory edge of a piece of plywood and a circular saw to make these long cuts, but it's giving me a jagged edge just a little bit. So I'm coming back around with a flush trim bit in my router to clean things up. Normally, not a big deal, but we want our ping pong table tabletop to be nice and flat, so this seam needs to be, well, seamless. <laughs> You can stop right here and have a nice sturdy workbench. We'll move on to the next step to ping pong glory, take the top back off, and start installing hinges. How to frame 
You might want to use a piano hinge here. I was a little afraid it might not be strong enough, but you'll get a much cleaner joint between the leaf and the tabletop. Okay, now I gotta figure out how to keep these table leaves up. I'm sure there's a more clever way to do this, but I settled on just drilling some 45 degree holes in some pieces of scrap wood, then taking them to the bandsaw and cutting a slot to receive a piece of 3 quarters inch pipe that'll fit between a 45 degree hole drilled in the table leg and the underside of the table leaf. With the painting done, all that was left to do was make some hardware for the net. And the bench is finally finished. I could not be happy with how this turned out. I'm probably going to add some shelves or some drawers underneath at some point. But for now, I'm just going to enjoy playing some ping pong with some friends. Thank you so much for watching. Like seriously, I love you. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more like it, hit subscribe. You know, if not, we can still be friends, it's fine. But either way, I'll be back next week with another video. See you then.